Hello class, this is one example, it's in your textbook, it's example um, 2.23 and you will find this on page 83. So the question here is that you are given the system, um, this system that you have, so you have a motor um and all the particulars of the motor are given on this side of the drawing and then you have the mechanical part which is here so this is the mechanical part uh which is being primed by this um by this motor and the question is you you have the system and you also have here you have the um the torque um omega uh there's a torque speed curve for the for this system so this this is for for this system and then you are asked to find the transfer function find g of s equals to theta l of s over e a of s so this is what you are uh, asked to find. So the first step is we solve for the mechanical uh, part. So we look at the mechanical part, which is this part. And then I said first solve for the mechanical mechanical part. So in this, what we are about to, what we need here is what is your equivalent M and what is your equivalent, uh, sorry, what is your equivalent um, inertia and what is your equivalent viscous damper. So you can see that our equivalent um, inertia will be JA of the armature plus JL of the load N1 over n2 square and this will give us we have the j a here which is 5 plus the j l we have the j l there which is 700 and then we have n1 which is 100 by n2 which is 1000 and whole thing square so if you simplify this you'll have that j m will be equals to 12. now we do the same for the m equivalent of the viscous damper and this will give you d a plus d l n 1 over n 2 whole thing square and this will be equals to so our da we can see that the da is given as two newton meter there and then plus and then we have our dl which is given here as 800 and then we have the ratio again 100 over 1 thousand square and if you compute this you will find dm uh, to be equals to 10. so we have the value for our dm uh, jm and we have the value for the equivalent uh, viscous damper so next we're going to find the electrical constants from the torque speed curve so we have our torque speed curve here and from this, we're going to find our electrical constant. So we know that the T stall is equals to 500. And so our, uh, and then omega no load, it's here, is equals to, 50 so this is newton meter this is 
Newton meter and this is uh, radians per second. So we have this and then we you know our applied voltage which is equals to 100 volt. Therefore our KT over RA which we know to be T stall over E a will give us T stall 500 over 100, which is equals to 5. So we know KT over RA. And then our KB will be EA over omega no load which is equals to 100 over 50. This is equals to, to 2. So we know our KT over R A and then we know KB. So if we substitute this into our equation, so recall the equation that we derived of theta M S over EAS is equals to KT over RAJM over S S plus 1 over JM DM plus KT, KB over R, A. So now we're going to substitute the value for, we know KT over R, A to be 5. We know our JM to be, that will be the, the equivalent, um, yeah, I think it's here. We have JM to be 12. And then we have our DM, which we calculated here to be 10. So we can substitute these values and we will have our theta M over E A S to be equals to 5 over 12 over S, S plus 1 over 12, 10 plus, this will be 5 times 2, this is 5 times 2, and so this will give us theta m over E A is equals to zero point four one seven over S S plus one point six six seven. All right, but we are looking for the relationship between theta L over E A of S. These are all in the S. So in order to find this, we need to, in order to get our theta L, um, we need to use the, the gear ratio. We know that theta L is equals to N1 over N2 theta M. So theta L will be equals to theta M over 10. Since we know that the gear ratio N1 over N2 is, is 1 over 10. Um, or from here we can see that theta L is equals to 10 theta M. So we substitute this here. And so we have... 
our final desired answer, which is theta L over EA, all in the S domain, will be equals to 0, 0, 0,0417 over S, S plus 1.667 yes and this is and this is the answer good